She thinks she's all that. She thinks everything revolves around her. She thinks that it, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Why do bad bitches go through the most? Like, why do you have to treat us so weird? I don't understand. Like, leave us alone if you're not ready. Like, it's never going to give. We're going to settle for shit. So leave us alone. It's hard being pretty and single because nobody actually believes that you're single because you're pretty. So you just stay single. So now you're just pretty as fucking single. Real pretty girls. No tea, no shade. Is a girl's girl. They don't got to hate. They don't got to be mean. God has shed his grace on us, literally. Like, I don't know who started that trend, but bring it back. This guy the other day was like, you need to put me on your roster. And I was like, first of all, sir, there is no roster, okay? I don't have a roster. I'm not really good at multitasking. And second of all, there's a line, all right? You got to wait your turn to get traumatized, all right? I can only ruin one man's life at a time. I'm going to let y'all know this from one pretty girl to the next. Because y'all be thinking everybody just got it all good in this world. For me to be a beautiful girl with everything going for myself, my lineup <laughs> sucks. All the men I deal with is a piece of trash, okay? I have yet to see a relationship that I would give up being single for. I already know I'm going to get hate for this one. But does anybody else, when they've got nothing else to do but their hair's done, their makeup's done... I just walk around the shops aimlessly, hoping people look at me. <laughs> so stupid. But, like, I think it's because I'm ovulating and I'm on the hunt for a boyfriend, probably. I'm like, hope I'm not going to meet them at home, am I? No, I need to go out and be seen and hope someone asks for my number or something. Like, I was just at, my, at the gym and I was like, oh, I need to get protein. And my PT's like, oh, we'll just go get some protein from the shop around the corner. I'm like, I'm not going to some dingy, no one knows about shop. I'm going to the shopping mall, a big centre, the biggest one in Adelaide to be seen. This cannot go to waste. I'm sorry. <laughs> so Does anybody else do this? Yesterday, a man approached me and he was like, your face gives off this like get away from me vibe and I was like thank you it's so sweet I do want you to get away from me there is nobody past present or future that is full of more false hope and bravado and uh just misplaced confidence than a man who is trying to pull it over on an intelligent woman y'all someone commented on one of my posts They're like Kelsey you're getting too old to hate men and that's crazy because I think as I get older, I actually hate men even more and they terrify me even more because when I was like 20 through 25, like I thought men were my BFFs. I was like, oh my God, guys love me. They all want to be my friend. Little do you know, they don't want to be your friend. I mean this shit in the least cocky way possible, but bro, only a hater is going to call me ugly. Only a hating ass op is gonna call me ugly. I can pull my type, your type, your mama type, your daddy's type, your uncle, your stud cousin. There's no limitations when you're just fine. Thank you. Nation with you is a fucking privilege. <laughs> your time, it's a fucking privilege. They have to earn that. And if they don't, goodbye. You wasted my fucking time. And you can't give it back. And sir, if you text me and ask me how my day going and I tell you that it's not going well and you don't respond back and ask me how can you be of service? How can you help? How can you fix it? How can you make it better? Don't worry about it. Have a great life. I get asked this question a lot. Why are you single? Why you don't have a man? You're so pretty. You're so beautiful. Why are you not married? My response every time. Because I'm intelligent. It's just that simple. <laughs> That's the truth. May the force be with you. <laughs>